That's crazy. Soccer is incredible thing for the And then into international countries to play Yeah, why not? Why not? I think, I think, um, you know, with social media, with the platforms, uh, with the digital platforms, um, you know, it's like the world has kind of shrinked, you know, and then it's brought everybody closer. Um, you know, I think, I think we can now cut deals all over the world, you know, whether it's in Japan or whether it's in Dubai or in the UK. So I'll be sitting down with Canelo in the next couple of weeks and, uh, and we'll figure it out. Awesome. Hey, ask your Jim Hill to you want me to say hello. Oh, oh Jim, yeah. yeah. I'm just trying to say hello. Hey, tell him, man. Hey, tell him I say hi. I didn't want to leave before. I got his number, so you tell him. Oh, yeah, tell him I right. call him. So. All right, cool. All right, I'll take Appreciate it. it. Oscar, for being such a legend in boxing and having so many legendary nights and legendary rules, uh, let us know what it means to you to be a promoter and have the responsibility and the charge to take care of your fellow fighters. You know, it's... it's um, it just it just gives me a great joy, you know, to 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 promote the next generation, you know, and 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 and, and build them and become champions, and you know, it's it's just a lot of fun, man. It, 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 I love being in the game outside the ring. It, it it really fills me because you know we're we're making we're making legends, we're making fighters who are becoming world champions, and so it's it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. A lot of people don't agree with your choice as a promoter. They kind of forget how credible a fighter you were and how you fought literally everybody at their prime. No, I think, look, I mean, just just watch my fights on YouTube, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> and then you'll remember quickly. Um, no, I think, look, I mean, yeah, it's, 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 it's not a, I don't want to say a double-edged sword, but it's just, no, I think, I think people will always remember. I think, I think, you know, I mean, when you think about it, you know, Oscar De La Hoya, you think, you instantly think about, okay, I fought everybody, you know, in their prime, and I love fighting, you know, the best, um, you know, but you think about the gold medal, you think about the six divisions, you know, the 10 world titles, um, you know, so, but being a promoter, yeah, I mean, sometimes because the audience is becoming younger or it's a new generation, maybe sometimes, not that it gets overshadowed, but it's like, the focus now, yeah. The focus now is on the fighters, you know. And I don't mind. It's fine. It's hey, I'm, I'm the promoter, and I'm, I'm, I want to help them. So it's, it's all good with me. You're Mexican American, and Ryan is also has that. That is, he's Mexican American. He has to appeal both to Mexicans and to you know his fans here. What advice do you usually give them so they can appeal more to the Mexican fans? Just be yourself. Just be yourself. Be yourself. You know, and 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 be yourself, and uh, and they will come. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> it's like it's like what's the name said in base that was the baseball movie. Uh, if you build it, they will come. You know, it's like hey, just be yourself and they will come. That's it. I think yeah, there's a lot of boxing now on TV on the different social like the platforms, the digital platforms, and um, you know, Fox is doing a great job, and and you know. Um, with the zone and um, ESPN, I think the problem is is that there's there's now too many world champions in every weight division, you know, and it's getting a little confusing. Even me, sometimes I don't like like who like who's that, you know, and that's me that's been in boxing since I was five, and I have to know these things, you know. So I don't think it's worse. I think it's it's better. It's evolving. Uh, it's growing, but we have to control a little bit more you know and 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 uh because uh yeah your casual fan who follows boxing for the first time doesn't know who the champion is in any given weight class and that's a big problem i don't know if i don't know about unionizing the sport will even help um I think it's just a matter of sitting down with promoters, like locking us in in a room, you know, and throw away the key until. Like when they choose the promoter. Yeah, you, right. Yeah, lock us in a room, and if you see the smoke, that's yeah. if it's gray. If it's gray, it's a problem. If it's, you know. Um, Yeah, no, look, we've we've done fights in recent years with top rank with 
Dabala, with everybody. I mean, even with, with Al Heyman, we've done fights with him. But we have to do more, you know? We have to do more because time is passing by. Time, you know, it's like, let's stop. Let's stop, you know, all these promoters, they, they want to milk. They want to milk and milk and milk. No, let's make these fights happen. That's how we grow the sport. Does Oscar De La Hoya in welterweight clean out this era's uh, welterweight division? Um, does he what? Does she clean up this uh, generation's welterweight division? Oh, come on, brother. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, guys. Thank you, Appreciate brother. it.